hello YouTube and welcome back to your tutorials and in this tutorials I'm going to teach you how to add uh, your Fapicon here what I, I mean by Fapicon is if you look at this uh, title page here you'll be able to see this ZAMP icon so we are going to learn how to change this or if you look at if you look at our demo uh, website I have already changed it to my custom icon so this thing here is what they call Fafikon. So I'm going to show you how to change this. And another thing I'm going to teach you today is uh, how to add what link to this uh, side uh, widget here. Like in your own website or in your own demo, the one you're using to follow up with these tutorials. If you point to this uh, banner here, it's not going to show you a finger sign. It's going to show you like this kind of uh, mouse pointer. But for now, because I've already linked it, if you point at it, it's going to show you what? A finger like this. So we are going to learn how to add this link. And also we are going to learn how to do uh, this music of the week. Just as this one here. We are going to learn how to add this music of the week here. Which is this music of the week. And also how to add this download link here so in your in your own this one here will be blank so i just added this uh image and also added this one and this one so if time permits we are going to learn also how to add a, a video of the week then the download link so every other thing or any other thing we are also going to do it so let's get started the next first thing you need to do is to log into your control panel just as what I've already done here then go to what uh, scroll down go to Mega Mac option which is Mega Mac shared on uh, WPLocker.com click on the general so when it loads anyway you see in a second what I'm talking about so when it loads uh, you find out that I've already added a logo here under this Fapicon URL, I've already added something here. So I'm going to show you how to generate your own Fapicon. So what you need to do is to... This is my YouTube channel. So you can subscribe if you've not subscribed. So I'm going to type in google.com and click on what search. What I'm showing you now is how to generate your Fapicon. So if Apicon is a 16 by 16 image. So I'm going to show you how to generate one now. So click on what? Just type in Fafi Faficon. Faficon. Probably Faficon generator. Click on it. Then this first one, you are going to click on the first one. Or you can use any other one if you prefer any other one there. So click on what? Browse file. To upload an image the image must be in a GIF JPEG or pink format so click on browse file locate the image you want to use for me I'm going to use you can use any one any custom one that will display very well but for me I'm going to use this one so I'm going to click on what open then click on what generate Faficon generate what Faficon so after you you generate the Faficon uh, you click on what download uh, the generated Faficon here so click on this one then it will be downloaded sorry after you click on that it will pop up a download so you click on what download I've already downloaded it so so after that, I just extract it. For me, I've already extracted it. So it's in my folder. This folder, a new folder. Then you have it here. So extract it to a new folder. Then go back to your, sorry, go back to this place and click on what? Upload Faficon. So once upload Fafcon opens, the next thing you're going to do is to do a select files. So just like you're uploading an image, 
choose it i've already uploaded it so i'm um, anyway let me upload it for the second time for this tutorial so as it's uploading here as you can see uh zero percent now then finished so what you need to do is just scroll down scroll down then say use as what Fafcon. so i'm going to click on use as Fafcon, and it will automatically add it for me so you have this Fafcon updated so the next thing you're going to do is to save your changes save changes and then refresh if you do it successfully you'll be able to get it so click on what save changes and refresh your website so once everything is successful you'll be able to see the Fafcon appear there so when you refresh uh, you see the Fafcon here just look at where you see this nigerloader.com look you see an image there so that is your Fafcon so the next thing we want to do is to display uh, to make our banners to be a link so for us to achieve that we go towards appearance and widgets so once you are there just locate any of your banner like for this first one locate it so the, what you need to do is just to add this link here the way it is so let me read it out we have what a uh, great uh, less than sign a target is equals to double quotation mark underscore blank close your double quotation mark then space h ref is equals to double quotation mark then you put the link that you want the banner to go to any link that you want then you close it here and also close it here then put the image inside it if you if you've already added image so just space it make sure the image is inside this closing tag here then you close the anchor link here so if you don't get it just uh copy the way it is and be able to watch my next tutorials on html so that you get familiar with what those things are so i'm going to save it and then if you refresh it you'll be able to have uh your banner to have a link like this so if you click on this banner it's going to take you to google.com because that is the link that we use there as you can see so if you can change this link to any link that you want but make sure you have the https which will make it to go to google directly and also which will make it to be secure so i'm going to pause this video and complete the rest banners this same way so uh anyway so i've finished adding uh the link to all the banners as you can see if uh, i hover this banner you see it changes to uh palm sign so i've added the links to all the banners so the next thing we want to do in this tutorial is to add uh, this music of the week and then this download button here which is going to be the last thing in this tutorial so let's get started for us to achieve this you will navigate back to your widget then under the banner that co that is for the music this one here what you need to do is to look for any image that is representing the image you want to advertise or that is representing the music you want to view like for me is this image so upload it uh, into your library then copy the url and paste it here the way we added other images so if you are just joining this tutorial for the first time i advise you watch other ones so that you get familiar with it so the next thing you are going to do after adding the image is to add a title page sorry the next thing you need to do is to come down you see text text widget just scroll down you see text widget here so carry it to the title page like this carry it up where you have your banner here so up then under it you type the title as to be what music of the week just the title and you save it 
and close it then at the downside what you need to do is to do what also carry a text and paste it here then under it you add a link so i'm going to explain to you how to get this link so the first thing we need to do in order for get in order uh, for us to get this link is this now if you visit ninja loaded website and then click on uh, the download mp3 just as this one click on download mp3 you find out that it's going to take you to a page that contains all the details of that music for example as you can see it here you have the details of that music here 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 before you see what download excuse me before you see what download button you see the details of this music so this is the same thing we want to achieve in this tutorial so for us to achieve that what you need to do is to excuse me what you need to do is So what you need to do is to do what click on the post or post then select the post that you want or that is representing this music the music you just uploaded so for me i use this uh, programming 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 so i'm just going to click on edit so i'm going to click on what edit then excuse me so what you need to do is to insert the music now so what you need to do is to insert the music for for you to insert this, this music anyway let me delete it just make sure that your pointer is at the downside then click on what insert download here so after inserting after clicking on the insert download it will pop up a menu like this so you click on the music you want so I'm going to click on this last music here, then click on this insert short code. So you'll be able to have this. Then you do what you update it. Now after updating it, what you need to do is to get the short link. So I'm going to click on what short link. You can copy this link here, this uh, long one, but I just prefer using the short link. So I'm going to click on what get short link. After that, I'm going to copy it. Excuse me. So. I'm going to click on short link get short link again so i'm going to copy it then i'm going to click ok then i'm going to go back to the widgets widgets here then so when uh the widget loads uh you just inserted this text here so open it and then so i'm going to delete this one so i would make sure you understand so this is what the short link that we copied so what you need to do is to add your link to it so you add your h href is equals to uh, then uh, what you need to do is to add your double quotation mark then make sure this one is inside it like that then add another of your double quotation mark here then close the opening tag then under here you type what download download uh, mp3 sorry then you can just close it let me close it here close this so then you click on what save so when it saves and you refresh your page you'll be able to get something like this so that when you click on it then it will take you to a page where you see the details of this particular music and also this uh, photo here and you also see the download link there also so let's just view it and let's make sure we are saying the truth so when you scroll down uh, excuse me excuse me excuse me all right so you have the music here to be downloaded and you can just download it so basically this is what we want to achieve in this tutorial so i know by now you will be able to add uh this one for the video 
so for the video what you need to do is just add a text widget then call it video of the week then be upload this video as upload it in the download section then copy the url as the post and also do the same thing that we did so if you didn't get what i'm saying or if you have more questions to ask just drop it on my comment box and uh anyway don't forget to subscribe and it's kapaski once again and see you